Hello, and welcome to the Stoic Tarot. My name is Adi. I do tarot and oracle deck walkthroughs. In this video, we are taking a look at when my soul whispered oracle deck, the cute little bee. Let's take a look. Inside of the box is bright orange. And here's a little owl. And it's a thick book. All right, let's see what we have here. Thick pages, large font, which I like. So, nice and easy for people with some visual impairments to see this kind of stuff nice thick font the passing of time has given me pause to reflect during days turn to weeks months turn to years and i become aware that time is fleeting how is it possible to find the courage to leave my comfort zone and enter the unknown change is a choice a decision to remain safe in my cocoon or to be transformed into a magnificent new version of myself every day i want to touch the lives of those around me in the most positive way possible with my face forward to the sun and my and a heart full of courage i begin the journey introduction uh when the soul when my soul whispered has begun my passion project has been my passion project since 2015 the process of creating this deck has been somewhat of a magnum opus for me. As much as I love to read guidebooks from different decks to discover the creator's intention, I also love to develop my own relationship with the cards. I have structured each page as follows. Keyword, quote, meaning my light, my shadow, sacred words, chakra association, the use of color, chakras, spreads, and let's see ah the cards okay so you get oh you got a couple of pages that's why the book is so thick okay so i'm gonna there's balance for the b actually belong interesting okay so i'm gonna hold it here hopefully you can make out what it says feel free to pause if you need more time i'm going to flip to the next page and there's the next page. Again, I hope you can read it. It's shiny, thick paper, so it's kind of hard to bend backwards. But uh, yeah, that's where the rest of the deck goes. It's just kind of, you get about three pages for each one. And uh, yeah, interesting. Set that aside. Take a look at this. Inside of the box is orange as well. Let's open this plastic. Ooh, it's shiny. It's gold. Gold is best. Yes, you get shiny sides. I like that. Okay. And let's see. The artwork is lovely. It looks like ink and watercolor, maybe. Some splotchy stuffs here. That's nice. I like the font. I, I, like, I like everything about this, actually. It's quite nice. Nice thick cards. They're kind of shiny. Good slip. Uh, this deck goes for about $25. You can find a link for it in the description box if you want one. Oh, I like these. I like this too. I really like the minimalism of this, oh, of this deck. Some of the cards are a little stuck together. I've noticed that tends to happen when decks have edging like this. The edging can cause some of the cards to stick together. That's totally fine. I love the watercolor. Trying to make sure I'm not getting a, I'm not taking away two cards when there's thinking that they're one.
I like the line work, like the shading line work is quite nice on this. some repeating or oh, very similar flowers are they the same design no they're, they're different designs they're very similar Microcosm. Mm, okay i like this this is really nice again you've got that like nice gold edging on the side very pretty okay that was the deck i hope that you enjoyed it if you did, please give the video a thumbs up, and uh, if you like these kinds of videos in general, you can head over to my channel. I've got over a hundred other videos just like this one for you to have fun and browse through, um, but I'll see you again soon. Bye!